in our third year, we've raised the bar. Transitions is now part of a foundation for eye health awareness, which is the industry coalition that is trying to educate consumers about the importance of eye health and the eyewear that they're choosing. We started off on Sunday, and we've renamed the walk to Think About Your Eyes Family Walk. All proceeds going to Prevent Blindness Florida. And we raised record proceeds for that charity, so we're very proud of that. We had over 400 people walk, back nine of the Copperhead, very exciting. We had a great barbecue, and we had lots of activity and interaction. The most exciting thing about Monday is, again, having Youth Day. The buses rolled in in the morning with a beautiful day of weather. We started off with over a thousand children. They went through the Think About Your Eyes Pavilion, and they would have interactive games and activities, but most importantly, it was teaching them about the importance of protecting their vision. They all got screenings, exams, and many of these children required eyewear. So information has now gone back through the schools and to the parents to be sure to get these children a comprehensive exam so that they can get the proper eyewear. All right, you did good. You're all set. It's good to see them get out, have fun, and also learn and gain something from the experience at the same time. So it's, it's amazing. I can't even tell you. We have more industry partners that are participating with us this year to carry the important message to spectators, consumers, parents and children about eye health. We had Sean McKeel, PGA Tour Pro, come in and actually talk with our industry partners, not only thanking them for their contribution and participating, but talked about his own eye health and how he became more aware of it at a later time in life and how successful it is now that he knows how important vision is to athletic performance. In addition to that, this year, one of our great partners, Oakley, put on one of their pro-ams and they had record number of players, PGA Tour teaching pros and amateurs play, and the winner actually won a pro-am spot for Wednesday with the PGA Tour pros. And we got an opportunity to teach people about the importance of protecting their vision. Oh, these are awesome. Thank you very much. Wednesday, a thousand more children onto the golf course, education, clinics, activities, Best the Book Bus and distributing books to those children. They got to meet the PGA Tour pros. Opportunities to learn the game of golf. In addition to that, the charity contributions that the PGA Tour wives make in all communities. So we celebrate with them with a great luncheon in the afternoon. Thursday, we had a new event. It was Ladies' Day. And there were more than 125 women in the community that participated with a breakfast, LPGA Teaching Pro Clinic, and also some raffles and prizes, and there was a special guest panel there, including uh, Pete Serqua out of New York City, who is a physical trainer. Thank you so much for having me today. So the excitement throughout the week just kept building. We've moved the entrance, we've made it an experience for spectators as they walk in. The crowds are record. I've heard quoted by many people that have been here over the past 16 years, and they've never seen crowds like they've seen coming through the gates on Friday and Saturday. Our family's been owners here at Innsbruck for 40 years, and we've seen tremendous improvements since Transitions has taken over responsibility for this tournament. The nice thing here this week is spectators who come are getting free eye exams. They're learning about the importance of protecting their eyes. Transitions understands that importance of giving people that knowledge, and they're using this tournament as a means of trying to educate the consumers who come here. So it's a wonderful time. We're very pleased with the success, our ability to use the Think About Your Eyes platform campaign to educate children, consumers. Well, I learned that we can donate our formerly useful glasses that are still useful to other people. And uh, most major retailers have a box just at the entrance to their establishment. You can just drop them in. I'm getting ready to go to the eye doctor in a week and a half, and I'm going to get my prescription redone, and I'm going to add transitions for everyday use. We know we're getting the word out. It's been a great, successful marketing campaign throughout the year. We look forward to trying to raise the bar again next year. Yay!